All right, everybody, I don't have to tell you just how important of a mission this is. We're all stuck here for now, and we have this important diplomatic mission with the Smurf beings of Smurf Alpha Smurf. And Captain, I'm, exp I'm, I'm feeling extreme Smurfiness. Thank you, Diana. This is really important. We need the Smurf berries for our improved warp drive so we can fight the Borg. And uh, so we can't screw this up. And so we, ha we can't beam up. We're waiting for a window. And uh, Jordy's going to fix the transporter and get us up. So we just have to wait. We just have to be quiet. All right, everybody. All right. Aye, aye, Captain. What's up? Riker, is that your comm badge? Uh, Captain. Riker here. Hello, this is a recording from the Ferengi Collector's Operative. You have been fined by the Ferengi Collector's Operative for dressing your women. Please stay on the line and a representative will be in con- Did, did you really just get, get robocalled? Oh no, Captain. The Smurfs, they've seen us. Today was a good day to die. Shut up, Worf. Hey, everybody. It's Atomic Monsters. We have a big show today. Over here, Heather, as you can see, Heather's visiting. Being as crazy faced as possible. <laughs> <laughs> um, we got a lot of stuff to go through because you just brought a bunch of stock to go into the the uh, Essex. Uh, is it Comics and Collectibles show? Collectors Con. Collectors Con. Essex Collectors Con here in Windsor. And we have a booth, and uh, we got a bunch of stuff to go through. Uh, a lot of stuff that uh, I've picked up recently, and a lot of stuff that Heather has brought, uh, stuff we've ordered, and some stuff she's brought over just specifically for the uh, con, including the really cool uh, Star Trek Next Generation Inner Space set that I was just showcasing, which will be there at the con if you want it. With all these little figures, there's there's two Picards, and uh, Riker seems to be battle damaged, so obviously he didn't fare too well with the uh, the Smurf debacle on Smurf Go on Five or wherever it was. Also got this really really cool Playmates Enterprise bridge. I'm missing the bottom half though, but uh, I got all the side compartments. Without the bottom half though, it doesn't quite stand very well. So this is the uh, the Enterprise bridge after they crash in Generations, apparently. I'll put a link in the bottom uh, to connect you to the con. If you're near Windsor at all or in Windsor, it's uh, Saturday, November 30th. Uh, there'll be information on where to go. In the, in the link below and uh, you can come see me look for the atomic monsters booth it's two dollars to get in so it's pretty cheap i also found this really cool star wars outrider that's dash rendar's ship which is in like really good shape which is no longer canon well that's not true it actually shows up in the special edition so i guess it's technically canon I guess Dash Rendar is not canon though. So now it just floats in space with no driver. And uh, we also picked up a whole bunch of turtle weapons recently. I've been sorting them. So if you need any weapons for your turtles, I've got a whole bunch. I've been sorting and labeling them. So if you need anything, let me know. I might have it. You know, this uh, this video is not endorsed by, but it's completely fueled by Rockstar. And now let's get into the uh, all the really good goodies. We have like four boxes of stuff that, that Heather brought us, so we're gonna dig into these. That's all the oh stuff. yes, these came. These ones aren't going into the into the store. Into the store. These are actually for for Heather or for Melanie. <gasps> No way! <laughs> this one's got something loose in it, but... Probably just his weed. 
<laughs> you can put your weed in here. Put your weed in there. I also am trying to figure out what he was holding in his hand here. Jay's a bit dangly in the legs, if you know what I mean. You do. I love how you can comb their hair. Yeah. <laughs> so now we can redo the, the, the Jay and Silent Bob skit with actual Jay and Silent Bob uh, figures <laughs> instead of pieces of paper. He has like extreme smoking accent. It doesn't like go to like his lips though. It's kind of sad. I don't know what's rattling in him. Probably just like a loose screw or something. And I can't figure out what that is. He can he can smoke through his eyes. Yeah, it's not as it's not as fun. I'm trying to think what that could be. Uh -huh. That's what it's I couldn't cigar. figure out. But what? He doesn't smoke cigars. Yeah, that's what I couldn't figure out either. <laughs> maybe he's about to unroll it and make a big blunt out of it. Maybe, maybe yeah, maybe it's a blunt. That'd be hilarious if it was a blunt. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. what I think it is. But I, I would think Jay would be well, the one that. If it's a blunt, blunt, he can stab himself in the eye with it fine because you know it's not sharp blunts. Mhm. Mm yeah. Anyways, those are yours, then. Thank you. And uh, I actually don't know about uh, stuff like this at the con because it's mostly like comic and superhero. Yeah, and I didn't. I just brought stuff. it because I thought it'd be but, fun uh, in the store. I do keep these in the shop because mm -hmm. I do have like a lot of Sesame Street collectors. Tweetable. Oh, but Mike, look at this. I won this. Really cool zombie Steve Austin. Let me tell you, I had to hide that from Lucas. I'd also almost be tempted to just give it to him. He's got so much right now. Yeah. And Christmas is coming up. And I know there are people who like are hardcore WWF, WWE. For collectors. people who say that Stone Cold has no guts, here they are. Take a look. Yeah. I did like his one hand was like all like. I'll pull the Action Jackson thing. Yeah. Oh no, I or I got this. I picked this up at Target. So the Target was getting rid of a bunch of uh, of these, and I was half more tempted. More amigos. Yep. Yeah, I was half tempted to get the um, the um. Genie, the I love Genie one. Oh yeah. Yeah, but I didn't. I didn't get it. We have more Freddies for people mm. who wanted them. We have Pennywise's. One of those is going to be ours, so we're going to open it right now. It's actually Melanie's. You want, you want me to hold the thing so you can open it now? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Live awesome. unboxing. <laughs> <laughs> actually, you want to pick between them? See if any of them is better than the others. Yeah. I think so, there might be one more in there because we got four of them, and I kept one yeah. for Lucas and one for Mel. <clears throat> I kept the one that with the, that had a big dent in it for Lucas because I knew he was going to open it, but I didn't <laughs> know if you guys wanted to open yours or not. Great, now it's worthless. <laughs> you can you can hang out with Jay and Silent Bob. Yeah. <laughs> do the voice. Do the voice. I can't do the voice. Get me all float down here, Georgie. Yep. Yeah. Another balloon. Over there with the other parted <laughs> figures. All the Migos are going to be 25 Canadian at the, at the show. Oh, uh, well, that one I brought back. Oh. Yeah. Because I never unboxed them, and I was like, eh, yeah, he might go with the, the con. Yeah, you brought, I, I asked you to bring these yep, back. The I actually sent these with, with Heather the last time she was here. Uh, but because these are good con items, I asked her to bring them back. And then if they. If you want them, you can come get them at our table, and if they don't go, they'll just go back on our eBay store. Uh, some more Amigos. More Freddy. I think there are like, I think we got three Freddies, and then Wolfman. Frankies go well. Yeah, Frankies. The Frankies are pretty cool. I like them. Yeah, the, I, I kind of like the Frankies. The detail on them. Glad to get the. No, not this. Where's the other one? There's the other Dracula that uh, is there. It is. Oh, this is the one that's opening a bit. Uh, this one's a, this one's opening a bit. I know there was people who were asking me for a Dracula. This one's only twenty because of the opening uh, clamshell. Oh, it's blister. Blister. It's a blister full of clamshells. Mm -hmm. Clam blister. I, I would like I would like better if the Belagosi one was in the purple cape, but you know. Hmm. Oh, there's variants. There might actually be one. There, yeah, there is, and I looked. 
but I think he'd be prettier as well. Like there's there's two different versions. There's at least two different versions of Freddy with like different claw colors. Yeah. So come buy a bunch of Migos because we're testing the market to see if there's a market for Migos. If there is, we'll buy a whole bunch more of the other different types of Migos. Got some Black Series. When did we get these? I bought them. I picked them up. Nice. And they sat in my collection for a while and I was like, eh, make room for other stuff. Stuff? Mm-hmm. Oh, like Lisa Turtle? I remember when we bought that. Oh, that's for you. If you're not wanting it, then obviously we'll be in the con. Oh my god. <laughs> that's sweet. This is where you drink his brains. Made famous in the absolute best Star Trek episode, Spock's brain. Mm -hmm. You can totally relive it. Mm. Logic. It's from 1994. So that's pretty old. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. I thought if you didn't want it, it'd be a good con item. I'm not sure yet. I have to think about it. Mm -hmm. I always have a few surprises I don't tell Patricia about. Because <laughs> <laughs> otherwise it will be the fun. This one I'm, I'm actually a lot more tempted to. That's golf though. Yeah. I didn't think it would be a golf. You're not a golf fan. Not really. But I, I like I know you like peanuts. peanuts so. yeah. Oh, good. Uh, anybody need boxes for your strawberry shortcakes? I have extra boxes, or the uh, I think these are all for the babies. Um, this is for the original strawberry shortcake. Okay. This so one, this one is for the one baby that was from the original series butter cookie, mm -hmm. and then this is for raspberry tart. She was another like second series. Yeah, I remember um, when we got those. Yeah. I, I got them specifically because of the uh, the we were getting a good deal on just the dolls, but yeah. they came with the boxes. Well, he actually didn't have the box. He had different dolls in the boxes. Yeah, that too. Yeah. Which was weird. Yeah, that's that's why. That makes more sense now. Yeah. He didn't have like a strawberry shortcake, a butter cookie, if and a uh, Ribera. If, if, uh, this one has just the, the person's name. If you're Don Webb, we have your strawberry shortcake, and you can reach us to get it back. It'll be $500,000 for your strawberry shortcake. Uh, we have a general flag on card. And uh, this is actually one of my, one of my favorite... Uh, He-Man adjacent lines. Golden Girl actually came before She-Ra. A lot of people think they're like the fake She-Ra. We got some uh, outfits for anybody who collects Golden Girl or wants to dress up their She-Ra dolls. They do fit the She-Ra dolls. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's one of the fun parts about them. Yeah, they're like... I have a couple of them sitting over there. Yeah. I, I like them because they have the Barbie leg, like the bendy rubbery yeah, legs. Yeah, they have like the, they bend at the they knee. They have like metal pieces. Yep. And their Better costumes are like generally pretty, like you had a pretty wide range of actual like characters, not just like your standard, mm -hmm. you know. Next. Oh, this is a box of uh, Ninja Turtle stuff. Yeah, that's a Ninja Turtle box. Fishing Derby. Oh, and there is some, um, uh, there are some, um, Atari games in there, too. Yeah, I gotta go through my Atari stuff, and, like, I know I have some extras. These are all extras, too. I, I'm pretty sure you don't have any. Or Fishing you have Derby. Any. Or That's you didn't want them. people race fishes. And you were like, I didn't want, the, I don't want Fishing Derby. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember. Well, I wasn't, in, I wasn't too worried about getting Fishing Derby, yeah. but I am kind of wanting to, like, complete. I know you're, like, wanting to complete. That was so awesome, though, about the whole uh, new game that was found out for the Atari system mm -hmm. that they just found recently. Really? Yeah, they just, they did a whole, um, there's a whole post about it that it was, like, a homebrew kind of a situation, and they only made maybe 100 cards or so. And then you would order that. Complete in box. Instructions from there? No instructions, so I have no clue how to play this game because I don't have instructions. Does it go in my head? I don't know. <laughs> it's mission impossible. This uh, will self-destruct and... <laughs> it's smoking! So yeah, there's going to be some Nintendo games. So I'm probably keeping that. 
and I think I'm keeping that. Actually, Mission Impossible is definitely going in the in the, in the sale, but I act, I got to think on these because I think I was actually looking for these. Master's Quest, one of the hardest freaking Nintendo games ever. It's a classic. It's Nintendo hard. I get Nintendo hard sometimes. Well then. <laughs> <laughs> Or Imperial Dragons. Didn't I just have another right one? Right there. No, not that one. Like, no, well, we got two in this lot. They were the exact same. So I kept one. Yeah. And you got, I brought you one. You got the better one because the one I have is. Do like, I have that one? Um, got a bit TV. foot. By the TV? Like under it. Under it? I don't know. We'll go look what you're. Oh, uh, yeah, you do. Can you bring it here? Let yeah. me see which one's better. You want the silver one? Yeah, I'll bring them. I want to show people my, like, I, I love these. They're canon for, uh, Muto. Nice, so what are you gonna Oh, that one might be better because this one's, uh, missing a spike on its tail. Uh oh. It's battle damaged. Oh, no! Although I like the coloring on that one better. Oh, yeah! So, yeah, at least one of these is gonna be in the sale. Probably this one. Come buy it! He's over here with the other monsters. You're a monster. Oh yeah. We're all monsters. Ooh. Oh sweet. <laughs> you wanna put that on your bear? Um Ooh, I think it's a little big. Let's put it on Freya. <laughs> uh, give her the give her the nunchucks. Yeah. Check them in the belt. Did my did my uh, hoodie come in? Yeah, it's in one of the bags. Oh yay! One of the boxes somewhere. I'm pretty sure I packed it up to come. I think you actually have this one. I think so too. There's a ton in there. I'm oh gonna... look, your ace your ace duck doesn't have this. No, yeah. So now your ace duck is more complete. I wonder if the wings are in there. No, there were no wings. We're slowly collecting a complete ace duck. Oh, you're only missing one uh, bomb or two bombs then. That's nice. Yeah. Two uh, grenades. Or er, I don't know if this goes with him because look at the belt. So. Yeah, that's his. That's his. I'm like ninety percent sure. It's just so the belt. I was so... just looking through like Ninja Turtle. Yeah, you were. Stuff, but, uh... Just the belt's a weird. Uh, weird Your belt's angle. weird. Well, I I mean when I wear one. <laughs> it doesn't dig in my There you go. There's your, your, your good Mondo Gecko came in. Nice. I love the little skate on his tail. Yeah. That's an awesome detail. That's one of the things I love about the Playmate lines is like the details they put into things. Did you guys watch the toys that made us the yeah. turtles one yet? I'm surprised yeah. it took them so long to get the turtles. Uh, I think they were trying to focus on like more like in like like chronological order kind of a I thing. Guess. Because now they're hit, like they hit G.I. Joe and then they hit. Uh, There's your, your dog found. There's actually two of them in there. Good. Cool. There's your Baxter. Before he's a fly. Before he becomes a fly. Yeah. That's sweet. Yeah. We already scared him away with that tranquilla. Shredder was so mean. Yeah. And now Baxter won't come back. Yeah. More fish so legs. You were you were you were hoarding fish faces for a while. Yeah. We even have a fish face hot cut wheel upstairs. A fish legs too. Oh yeah. Fish, fish, fish. Oh there we go. And the new Yeah, the new is pretty cool. Neutralizer. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I think the um the Nickelodeon toy line is definitely my favorite of the turtle lines matching probably with the 80s line yeah i think there's a lot much better like variation in character design and i think they're better like action figures overall but the other ones are also like more durable and i like you look like that sculpting on the tail and stuff little details yeah. like that the the new figures don't quite have as much yeah yeah i mean I guess it depends upon the figure. 
My only gripe with the new line is they released some of them so limitedly, and they were like a pain in the butt to get for Lucas. Oh, it's, it's the breakdancing one. I think we actually, I think I actually have his, his weapon in one of those baggies. No, I think he's just the spinning, isn't he? Just oh, just spins his the, weapon. Yeah. With like uh, hand jerking action. Uh, uh, we might get flagged on this video. <laughs> <laughs> we got general flagged on He His army's a little TLC. I couldn't figure out what year that one was for. 90, it says 1991. Okay. It's the 1991. Okay. Part. I looked everywhere, but not obviously where you just looked for it. Do you want the, the turtle bike? I'll think about it. Yeah. I think we can probably find you one better shape than that. Anybody want a turtle turtle bike? It's in great shape. <laughs> we'll put Mikey on pound. it. Yeah, there's your other dog pound. Oh, let's compare this to yours. See which yeah, that's Luke. Uh, ironically, Luke did not want that one from the Viacom line. So do you have the uh, the, pe the pieces at all? Mm mm. I know this is one of one of Mel's favorite pieces. It always that's why it's always here. We picked that one up. I picked that one up second hand for Lucas. Yeah. So. Of him. Yeah, he doesn't have any stickers on him though. Yeah. This one's cheaper. <laughs> <laughs> This is this one covered up all his tattoos so he can get an office job. <laughs> oh, hell. You breaking things? I just could never figure I was like I could never figure out how to replace the batteries in it. Now I just figured out how. I'm confused by this this bent staff that kind of looks like it's supposed to be a microphone, but it's um it's from the where they do the dungeon and Yeah, yeah, I, I, I yeah. okay. Okay, yeah. yeah. He has a wizard hat that he wears. Yeah. We, we were, staff we, of I remember truth. we were excited to get these, but we're going to have to like hair dryer his, his stick. Luke's is all notoriously bent up too. And I want to complain about, a lot of people, like I want to complain about new toys for this problem, but like literally, my t staff has the exact same problem and it was worse when I got it. Yeah, it's <laughs> the way plastic is. It's a, it's a softer plastic they use for stuff like that, so it doesn't poke people in people's eyes out. Well, damn it, I want to get poked in the eye. <laughs> I need that sucker to be sharp. Well, there's a. I'm sure Silent Bob will willingly help you out with that blunt. <laughs> 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 oh, we're totally getting flagged now. <laughs> there's a tiger claw. That's the one. It, like literally, when Lucas was going through a fa his turtle phase, like really actively into it. I couldn't find this guy for like six months. It was terrible. And his, you're missing his tail. No, he's not. Oh, that's right. His tail is missing in this. Yeah. Thing. Duh. But I couldn't. Wait, watch some episodes or something. I couldn't. I forgot about it. Another ace duck. Like, I don't think we can call him ace because ace kind of means one and we have like five. So is he dose? It's like quint. This is quint duck. <laughs> quint duck. <laughs> There's the. Diving, diving Mikey. I, I didn't understand why he had to wear things on his feet because he's a turtle. So, <laughs> like, why did he need a wetsuit if he's a turtle? It looks bodacious. I'm just confused by the little dolphins that he's got tied to him. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I never understood this one. I, it was just one of those ones I was like, hmm. Aha, we're slowly putting together yeah. the D&D &D line. hit me from behind sneak attack extra 2d6 spread the leg oh my god that's the one thing about this line that it's hard to get them to they're hard to from. Pose, they're hard to pose from behind yeah it's party <laughs> time oh blow on it blow on it Ha, ha, ha.
do you have to keep this one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Look yeah. at this, it's a Congo line. And there's the classic rock Leo. So you were all given a music genre, mm -hmm. classic rock Leo. Mikey got rapping, and uh, Raph got heavy metal. Donnie got punk. <laughs> I would think Raph should have been punk. No, well, mm. it's like all the others kind of make sense, mm -hmm. but I kind of think like Donnie should have got like synth pop. Yeah, like, and he should have been dressed dressed like the. Uh, oh, like a, he should have been dressed like the guy. Hair. He should have been dressed like the guy in Revenge of the Nerds with the electric violin. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he could have like a flock of seagulls hair. That would have been cool. It's flip. It flips and it like yep. changes and. Uh... And just uh, mutate and shred. Missing a part of the leg. I have like I think the in, in the uh, in the weapons that I was sorting through. I found almost all the parts for all the mutating characters, but I don't think I have shredders. I'm not quite sure how to finish his mutation. Oh, there we go. But what, does that e what does that even open up for? Is that where it's like stuff goes? I don't know, but this like folds in here. Yeah. Like this well, part. Well, to close it up. Yeah, it's supposed to, to open up and turn into like a cloak. You'll have to look at some videos. I'm going to look at how it finishes. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, that's see, that's where the other head goes. That. Oh yeah, yeah. See, that's supposed to come out, but the thing's broken on it. He's seen some things. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Arokosaki. I've had better days, <laughs> like before my face got fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> this one's from the 2004 line. You actually have to go through the weapon baggies I have and match things up. There's a couple of these from this line in there, I think. Yeah, that's the 2003 line. I kind of like that line. I like the cartoon for that line a lot more. The toys, less so. Some of them are cool. I did like the hands, how the hands were like a beach yeah. grip. He's got a wonk leg, you know. He a bug. I wonder if his wonky leg bugs him. <laughs> Could. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, there's another one. Let's see if this one works better. Yeah, that's how anatomy works. <laughs> <laughs> well, so if my wrist going around like that works. I'm quintuple jointed. Oh, there's, another there, one. there's a better one. What was this guy's name? I always forget. He's like later. Yeah, um, he shows up in the Archie comics. I can't remember his name right now. He's missing, like, some spikes that come out of his chest or something. He's missing his nipples? Oh, my! Anybody want a nippleless bug? <laughs> These are the ones with, the, with the, the talking ones. I don't remember, yeah. Oh, is this the one you put like the rip cord in? And it like, it like rip corded it? Yeah, we now have an extra one of him. Oh no, only one There's somebody's tail. Oh, that goes to um, this guy. Ah! I feel more complete. Shut up, Bradford. Oh, sweet. What we have his leg. No, I'm missing his leg. Eh. Eh. <laughs> I think it was like a hook or something. I it know it's like... a, it's a, it's a um, a chair leg, stabbed into a pizza box, <laughs> and a bunch of goop. Uh. <laughs> Did you ever watch You Can't Do That on your Television? Oh yeah, I love that show. So that like guy totally reminds me of Barf from the. Barf. Barf. From Barf. the Barf. Uh, Guy. Mikey, I'm an elf! There's no ring of awesomeness. He doesn't come with a ring of awesome. 
I don't remember. You know the the uh, yeah. No, his, I mean I don't ring remember. Of, his ring of awesome has the same art on it as Napoleon Bonaparte's shirt. Oh, I know. I don't re- like Luke has the full set, and yeah. I don't know if his came with it either. Is what I meant. Yeah, I don't think it. I, I, I think it was added in the show, so I don't think the toy actually got it. There is the the gayest Michelangelo. Hey, Taylor. In the Navy. In the Navy. There's a whole series of these. They did. They, they all came with a. They all came with an American flag. Oh, really? Which were like foot smashing flags. And they each are a different part of the the uh, armed forces. Oh, the armed forces. <laughs> In the neighbor. Yeah. We want you. We want you. We want you as a new recruit. The most patriotic of turtle figures. All I can think of whenever I hear that song is the Jim Henson um, Muppet Muppets one that they did. Yeah. <laughs> I, got, I think I got a couple of his weapons. I don't have his gun though. He's did he came out for the movie, the third movie? No. No? Okay. It, he may have been around at that time, but he wasn't in the movie. He wasn't in the movie. That's where my... Which makes him luckier than all the other turtles and stuff. <laughs> That's where my turtle knowledge starts to get a little hazy. Okay. Oh, look, we get... <laughs> no. I'm completely confused by the candy cane. But look, we got the sailor, and now we got the cowboy. <laughs> so we need the construction worker and the, Native the, co- American. the Native American one. And then we, was there five of them? I thought there was a cop, too. Oh, there? yeah, there is a cop. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God, you should do, like, if you get them all, like, if we get a, dress them up and then, like, make them dance to the little thing. Oh, my God, that'd be hilarious. Oh, that's cool. That was a bur- That's a burger yeah, thing. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's got teeth marks. Yeah, somebody was a, somebody was a chewer. We got somebody at Burger King. Is this a burger? <laughs> <laughs> it's supposed to be a belt buckle, but I was like, what kind of belt could you actually put that on? I don't know. You want that one, hon? Um. Sure. Ta-da! <laughs> Ooh, I forgot I got you a mutagen, man. Sweet. Look at my innards. <laughs> there we go. Brother. You look familiar to me. They're the same person. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think this is like on the package like 2.0 or something. Yeah. That's how they have it labeled. Well, he, he's they they he's changed they changed his name to Razer. Yeah. So he matches like the uh, uh, the movie. I'm standing on this thing that's hard on my feet. Comfort. Aha! That matters. Super Shredder! That's a Shredder. We got you a Nickelodeon Shredder now. Yay! We keep finding you, like, naked ones. Yeah. Like, if you want a naked Shredder, you're like, no, I don't blame you. Sergeant Bananas, is that yes. what his name was? Yes. Okay. <laughs> He's the army guy. <laughs> In the Navy. Stop, da- stop laying down, Private. <laughs> Dude, oh take God. a pill. So many turtles. Yeah, those More are from that same, yeah, 2003 line. Space. The final frontier. I think it's the most complete of the 2003 space turtle that I've seen. He's been missing so much more. Oh, you got the the, the cyber usagi. That's cool. <laughs> I don't think that's actually his cloak. And I don't think it's supposed to be torn like that. That's that's met some that's met some rats that weren't splinter. <laughs> <laughs> it was a little hungry. <laughs> Aha! No, that's it's, it goes to yeah. Yeah, Donnie. Leo. Oh shit, Leo. Sorry. Fired. But I know, I'm terrible. I'm having, I've been having brain issues lately. You know who this goes to? I want to say it goes on one of the vintage characters, but I don't know who. Also, I just noticed that the... 
At first I thought it went on a razor, but then I was like, I don't think it does because... Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. Maybe it goes in... I forget whose weapon that is, but yeah. I know I've seen this today. Yeah. If you know who this goes to, comment below. <laughs> Thanks! <laughs> and there's the CGI era turtles. Yep. Those ones I'm finding more often. Yeah. Like, yeah. They're, my only complaint with them is they're so tall and lanky. I mean, they are... The good face turtles. sculpts were good, though. But yeah, I like the face sculpts. They're, I mean, there's a little bit of derp on some of them, but they're they're overall really good. Uh, they, they hello, like... that's not severe derp right there. <laughs> but the reason why they were so tall is that the CGI movie is a sequel to the live action movie. Oh, okay. And uh, they were all uh, in this in the movie made about the same size as their live action actors, so. When they made the toys for them, this is what we got. Oh, good. Raff. He's mm -hmm. got like a Viking helmet, I think, that goes with him. Well, like a fake, what they consider to be a Viking helmet. <laughs> like, yeah, the Viking helmets didn't. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, horns. yeah, I mean, like the quote unquote, like, yeah. I keep getting this one. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, second rat king for you. Nice. There's your slash. Yay. Just gonna chill out with the D and D guys. I wanna play too guys. Can I be a bard? I can sing. I seduce the dragon. Oh, now we got you a, a complete one. Oh, what were you guys oh. missing before on them? The wings? Yeah, we just picked them up. Oh nice. There's I love how he's got like shelf. One shorter arm. Yeah, I love it. It looks like they probably like there's a there's a seam, so they clearly had made it a separate arm, and I'm expecting that probably it was like rubber. Cause like, oh, because it like a like a. Wet. And they probably you know what this doesn't working, so they just molded it to the, the to figure. The but there's clearly there was a, a there At was one a, point an, yeah. a, an articulation point there. I'm gonna put that where that one was. Actually, you can you can hang out with your daughter. It's April, Dad. Yeah. So sad. He was over by the end of the turtle bus. Yeah, he was. But you can't see. He's not going to fit not there fit anymore. There, yeah. And I'm trying to fit him with April. You were going to have to rearrange. Yeah. Always having to rearrange. Well, we have a whole bunch that are going to yeah. go in the collection. You can sit over here and you can, April can ride. So at home, my, uh, the space dragon. my Wonder Woman and my Harley Quinn ride on one of those <laughs> in my collection. There we go. There. Oh, I, uh, this is um the Rock'em Sock'em uh, ones. They have a little remote control thing. There's one in there. that I don't know if that one goes with it or not, but there's uh, there's another one in the I, box. I have, I have the Karate uh, Turtle one. I think it was Leo. And they're supposed to, like, they there's have a remote a control thing. and Bebop in there. Oh, you do have the thing. Yeah, I have the Bebop, but I don't have the... Oh, no, I have the Rock Steady, but I don't have the... But his head's, like, not... It doesn't work. You have to push those, yeah. Only the one really kind of works. And I can't get his head to stay down. I can't get my head to stay down all the time either. Mm -hmm, it's a bad position to be in. And I don't know how to get him off that thing either. You don't know how to get a, a rhinoceros no, off? No, I can't get a rhinoceros <laughs> off. We're totally getting flagged. <laughs> 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 but Luke has a, um, they brought out something similar to this for like the Marvel Universe, and Luke has that for the Marvel Universe. They're also similar to the Karate Fighters, which I've been finding a lot of recently. There we go. You got your upgrade down. Neat. I actually think I have one of his weapons. And that's a, one of the turtle lines I like never remembered. Uh, this is the, the original one. Yeah, I, I'm sorry, I don't remember that from the Oh, line. yeah, they were, it was yeah. kind of, it was kind of late. Yeah. I might switch over to Mighty Morphin Power Rangers at the end. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's got a water gun. Oh. Fun. Oh, good. I was worried if we got you a splinter. Um, because I got a belt for splinter in that uh, weapon lot. 
one for because shredder and splinter have the same belt. Oh, they do. I didn't yeah. know that. Oh. And I put the I had two of them, so I put the one on the shredder. But I was worried if we got I forgot that I got you a splinter. Uh, but it already has its belt on it, so sweet. I don't have to like, nice. go and dig out the other one. You can go and chill. I'm the druid. Oh, cool. It'll his hair, his hairband, uh, headband coloring is weird. It's, it's like a cross light. between Mike and Raph. Yeah. yeah. It's Raphael Angelo. Yeah, somebody uh, Mikey L. wasn't paying attention at the coloring that day. <laughs> I accidentally dropped my lipstick into the dye. Is that okay? <laughs> but I think that's the first time we find you a uh, Nickelodeon Mikey's nunchuck. I like the, uh, Luke has the ones that they open up in the back for their weapons. So I'll just put in. Oh, my Fisher Space Pen pen. Yeah. We're missing his, his uh, helmet, oh, aren't we? Uh, yeah, Raph's helmet. That's got a Snoopy, uh... Peanuts! Right yeah, my, this is awesome. This is the uh, Fisher Space Pen. This will write in space. Don't ask me to prove it. <laughs> Gotta remember my message, my NASA guy. He's been waiting for this. So it's, so it's, it's bigger than a, a, a shuttle craft. <laughs> so you actually could fly to the USS Enterprise in that. What? That's funny. <laughs> oh my god. You want to do a part two? <laughs> <laughs> it's a uh, vintage Winnie the Pooh. Yeah, I'm thinking 60s on that one. There's no, no... The 1960s one has a wire in it. See, that one has wire in it. Is it? I can't feel it. You can't really it's feel it. It's a better it. shape than the other one. The other one because it's not poking through. Yeah, for sure. Just the face shape is still 60s. The other one's far more poo. This one's far more Winnie. Yeah. More pound puppies. This is a pound kitty. It's a pound purry. Pound purry. That makes sense. That way they don't have to change the initial. Mm-hmm. Get it right. Stray cat. Vintage fuzzy. Hey! <laughs> waka waka. Did you see that new commercial with him? Yeah. Yeah. For Amazon, uh, whatever it is. The He's handsome really person that, um, wanted to buy all the Fozzies, I sent them a picture, they don't want it, so that's yours. Yay! Go with your piggy. Yep. Mm. Sasquatch! Sasquatch! Some pure Canadian marvel going on here. Any more alpha clay? Uh, I don't know if there's some more in that of that line in there. There might be. He was just a random... There's Oh, there is a... Hercules in there somewhere. Oh, that, he's offended there. I don't think he's ever been in Alpha Flight. He might have been. He seems like somebody who they might act to actually just say, you know what, we don't work for you, let's put you in Alpha Flight for a bit. Mm -hmm. I think they teamed up for like maybe an episode <laughs> well, they, or they, something. Well, they've been in the same comic number of times. Yeah. <laughs> Some Voltron. Yeah, they're repos. They're not from the, they're like the 90s remakes of yep. them. 98. Mm -hmm. When um they're trying to recapitalize when the Power Rangers are like super popular. Yeah, the um re the reboot the uh, '90s slash early 2000s reboots of of uh, Voltron weren't great. They're okay. I prefer the new one. Yeah, the new one's amazing. Mm -hmm. I mean, I love the original. Don't get me wrong, but I like the new one. I actually have one of the lions from the the, uh, the new Voltron, uh, and that. I, I think if I remember, that's going to wind up going into the, the show as well. But these will be there. Let me just start with that. <laughs> I always thought the position of the lion's feet were so... Plus there's some Voltron action figures that are going to be in. I've got some original Matchbox Voltron uh, action figures from the 80s. They stop mess up. And G.I. Joe's. I think that's the only Joe I brought. 
Well, that you get off on. Yeah, but I mean, like, up loose. What the fuck's wrong with Hercules or shoulders? I don't know. He he looks like he's got to take a crap to me. Like, yeah. Like, the way he's, like, he's, like, hunched. Like, he's kind of... Like, he doesn't seem ripped with, like, his and shoulders like, back. He seems, like, hunched, though, like he's trying to he hold it in. he has enough room to move his legs out to the side... He can't. He can't. Yeah, it's a he's, really This weird... is the most constipated-looking figure I've ever seen. And he looks, like, he literally <laughs> looks <laughs> like he's trying to poop, <laughs> doesn't he? Give him, give him get a close-up of so his face. So he's some, like, citric, <laughs> citric <laughs> magnate or, like, some... Axlax or something. Yeah. Hold on, follow me. Try to make some, something look hyper masculine, what does it look like? It needs to be. You can just hang out. Oh, good, they came. Mm-hmm. Those, those have been, they came a while ago. Yeah. There's an LJN wrestlers. There's a Hulk. There's a Nikolai Volkov. And I believe we had a hammer. Yep, break the hammer valentine. I just watched that the other day on Toys That Made Us too. The size was completely accidental. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I never knew that. I thought I yeah, thought, I, I, that's that's something I learned too. I totally thought they would have purposely made them that big because of the fact that they're you know supposedly like a larger than life kind of a You won't you won't stand. No, none of them stand. I won't stand for this. Can you reach the duplex? Mm, kind of. <laughs> Before I spend all day. We have... Oh, my, my superpowers. Yeah, I, I brought him back. I thought he could be a good yeah. con. My, my Lexor. Uh, the, I wouldn't put the gem out with it, though, because that might get in there, but I wouldn't put it out when you put it on the table. And that's totally Can different, that different continuity. I know, it's supposed it's to be a, the same... It's Secret Wars. Is it? Yeah, I thought it was the Wars. same line. No. Oh. Same time, though. You can look at the art articulation differences. Oh, okay. Thing. Wait, this is a different line. Wait. No, oh, okay, that's yeah. a working Robin. He, he does work. He's like the best Robin we've ever found. Yeah. Without the cape, obviously. Sadly, Penguins does not work, this is, this is a This is a movie Joker, though. Uh, oh, is it? Yeah. I thought it was a Caesar Romero joke. Yeah. I clearly suck. No wonder why no one saw it. And there's a Lex, and there's a Penguin. Yeah. Well, the Lex Luthor obviously goes with the Lexor. Lexor. Yep. So maybe, I would maybe price that out separate. So I, I think 30 Canadian is what we were asking on the Lexor, with Lex Luthor. And Transformers, I have good and bad news. We had, all of my G1 Transformers, with the exception of like a couple, sold out last week. So I tried to do like an emergency order off of a friend to get a bunch of extras in. And it was supposed to come in today, and uh, in time for Heather to come here. And uh, even though two-day shipping was, was paid for, nope. So, but we did have some other G1 Transformers. It's not as, as much as I was hoping for. Oh, this is a, um, a Zybot. That's somebody's arm? What are you for? Random part. <laughs> um, oh yeah, the uh, Beast Wars 
turn it on. Snapper. Oh. Okay, snapper. <laughs> so one day I sat for like there's 30 another, minutes. There's another Zybot. And I was trying to figure out his like leg position and it and just... Uh, uh, McDonald's demolisher. <laughs> So I'm not going to have a lot of in, uh, great there's transformer no more, options on Saturday. There's one more transformer in the back somewhere. It's a big one. Yeah, I see it. Oh no! Kitty on the loose! There we go. Yep, Vector Prime, Transformers Universe version. Go and resort and replace all this. I tried to leave all the prices on it when I put it for you. I don't remember what that's. Is Something it's anime? I just can't remember which one. Yeah. His, his, uh, I'm, not, I'm not allowed to date on, on more modern anime. Yeah, his uh, keeps or whatever is like super soft though. Yeah. I don't want it. I'm like, it's so soft. I, I, like, I almost want to sleep with this. <laughs> it's super cute and awesome. feels like he's going to break into some Kiss songs anytime soon. <laughs> Hopefully he won't be as uh, is terrible of a person as Gene Simmons. This is the new boy band. <laughs> it's Fozzie Poo anime band. <laughs> Rainbow Bright! She has, um, like, so there were two versions of Rainbow Bright. So there's this one's the, supposed to be. Yeah, there's the like non wired one, yeah. but that's not actually wired. It's like Yeah, it's got like It's got like, like a clicking leg in it thing and that's not poking through. She's in pretty good condition. Yeah. Her hair doesn't look like she uh got up at like We do we also have the, the other other rainbow bright this size that's not posy, but that one has its sprite. And then this one with the other as well if you want to buy this one. I like the legs on that one. The way they grow. Oh, you are a leg lady. I know I am a leg lady. You can't help that. <laughs> it's the boots. The boots get me every time. <laughs> Is this one of my French ones? Uh, no, that's not a non talking one. No. For a while, I was collecting French, uh, French uh, ponies because I kept finding French speaking ponies. Only French. Only French. Oh, I am a Dutch. Not an original. It works nice. though. Oh, cool. I got it for Lucas and he told I me he did not like it. I will take your word for it because I don't <laughs> ever want to talk to it. He told me he did not like it and he thought it was creepy. <laughs> they, they are. <laughs> did you see that guy who made like a keyboard oh, out of Furbies? That's so awesome. Kissy Face Bears or whatever they are. What's it doing? Kissy Face Bears? Are they Kissy Face Bears? I don't bears? Know, like that. There's another one. There's three of them. He just fell out. Oh my god! Let's put the kissy face there but aside. Everybody ready to sing with me? Shoo-be-doo, shoo be be doo That one's the, uh, I can't, it's like, her name's like Sea Shimmer or something. She has like the star, the purple star on her chest. And the purple fins. She's like one of the more rare ones. Yeah. Sadly, I do not have any accessories to go with it. But. These are interesting. So they're Hallmark. So I didn't know Hallmark actually made these little, like, matchbox size cars. And they're super heavy. Yeah. They're super cute. They sat the on my shelf. The bus is amazing. I love Yeah, they bus. sat on my shelf for, I think, like, two. I've had them on the shelf for two years now. And I thought, eh, time to get rid of them. But the bus is so cute. <laughs> oh, this is going to be interesting to some people. These look like GoBots. And they sort of are. What they are is before uh, Tonka got the license to sell uh, Bandai's machine robo line in North America, Imperial made a bunch of knockoffs of them. And then Pepsi did a promotion using them. So these are Pepsi promotional items made by not Bandai, not Tonka, by Imperial, the same knockoff company that makes these dragons over here and then a lot of them have slight changes that make them kind of, in some ways better than the original figure like you look at well the they're switch. more metal on them than the original cobot lines were 
Well, the, the coolest thing, if you look at Slicks here, for instance, Slicks has completely different tires, and they remolded the uh, Slicks chest slash front end. Yeah, they I think they did that to save metal. Yeah, probably, but they're also more metal. Like the GoBots were not as much metal as these ones are. No, I got them about the same. Uh, hmm. They they seem heavier than the GoBots we've had in the past. But anybody who who uh, likes GoBots or Machine Robo or Mugen Bind, which is the basically the current Machine Robo line, mm -hmm. Mugen Bind, and wants a little bit of history, or if you like promotional items or knockoffs or you like Imperial, come get them. These things are awesome. We had uh, we had more of these and they sold. Yeah, uh, there's a blue one. And a, you know, another blue one and another red race car. Two blue. A blue we also we also had um, Jeep, Jeeper Creeper. Oh yeah, there. we didn't have Jeeper Creeper. Yeah, he sold a while ago. Yeah. Oh, I found him. I thought he was so adorable. <laughs> the Ultimate what's Warrior. He, what's he, he even him? doing? I have no idea. <laughs> I think he was a cake topper. That makes sense, sort of. I guess you're supposed to like make. Uh, like the icing? icing coming out. I have no idea, but I thought it's so cre cr like cr like crazy, wacky. Why doesn't he taste too so sugary sweet? I, I, I picked him up. I was like, somebody's going to love him. That would be awesome in someone's, like on the top of someone's computer monitor at work. That would be awesome. Maybe he's just slowly picking up the pony's poop as it comes out. I guess, I guess it comes out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, more carded smurfs. We sold, you sold the, most of the ones that we Yeah, have these left. are the last two. I thought we'd try them at the con and see yeah. if anyone liked them. We have some vintage smurfs. Uh, this one's 1995. Uh, we have one from 1982 or 81 upstairs okay. in the store, and that's going to be there. This one is this is more recent. Yeah, it's like a 2000. Yeah, this is when Jacques took over. Well, they were, they were still sleek, slight as sleek. They're still the same spleens. mold. They're yeah. still spleens. Spleens, yeah. But, uh, but uh, different, slightly different. More accessories. Yeah. Oh, is that one? Yeah, that one's posable, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is one of the new ones. I think that's like 2000. I want to say 2003 or four on this yeah. one. The Smurfs, the Smurfs figures and the Super Smurfs by Schleich, Foley, I used to make a painting of the one that made that they said bucket and started making gnomes. Oh, it's like a knockoff company. Yeah. I know what you're talking about. It's uh, another I, German company. Yeah. Um, is the longest running, uninterrupted, unchanged toy line next to maybe Lego. Yeah, I would believe that. Yeah. They they changed they no changes to them at all. They were the same P V C figures running from nineteen sixty two up until just just somewhere between the first and the second live action movie. Yeah. They made some slight changes to them um, in terms of like just the size sculpting because I've I found like some Yeah, well they're, they're, the newer the newer ones are sculpted using um, computers and stuff to, instead of like actual sculpting. So like, these ones are Irwin. Like if you uh, you can you can find they they did a whole bunch line of classic smurfs just before the line ended yeah. where they remade all of the old classic ones again using the newer technology, but they were still just PVC figures. Yep. We have more that Same are just scale everywhere. in box, and I haven't gotten to them. They're still in storage. Sure. I'll, if you want to bring them here. Well, yeah, if somebody's interested in them, send Patricia a message and I will expedite the uncovering of them from my storage. Yeah. <laughs> this is so cute. His head is so weirdly proportioned, however. I don't need more light, so I can put them with my other two. He's just a little chewy. <laughs> Straight in the plushie box. We're running low of stuff. Now this is a damned troll, which I thought was hilarious. So actually it's stamped on the bottom of his foot, damned troll. 1986. This is, this is like before trolls took off. Yeah. So this is before Russ bought the like basically kind of bought the rights yeah. to them from the damned company. So if you like trolls and you want some like really hard to find trolls, that's a really hard to find troll. Yeah. What's hilarious is is that Russ, in order to try to avoid paying uh, import duties, had a case in the Supreme Court, like within the court system, for twenty years about these freaking trolls. <laughs> My Grizzlor came. 
Bruce Lore is not going to be in the, in the show, but I am picking out some of my um, some of my He-Man figures and trimming down a little bit so I can focus uh, on more complete ones. So there will be a bunch of Masters of the Universe, just not this Grizzlor, because I'm very happy for this Grizzlor. <laughs> He's going to express what I feel about trolls very badly. Yeah, it does it. God damn it. Yeah, when we were kids, we just like this. <laughs> <laughs> I had them when I was a kid. Twins <laughs> united outside and in. We You're just the shit that was left over. Small soldiers yep. line. More small soldiers. Yeah, he's got like a. That archer? Yeah, it's the leader archer leader. Yeah. Got like an arm chopping. Quite violently, like. What's that archer? Did you have to go to the bathroom? Oh, bro. <laughs> <laughs> there's one more in there, too. Oh, there's more? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Which I press it and he flips his head for it. Oh, that's cool. I want. I wish my head turned into a gun. <laughs> I don't really. <laughs> Very impractical. <laughs> yeah. Wacko, he's a bendy. An anime. Oh, I now have two of this guy. Yeah, I didn't know if you had her or not. Lucas said he was done playing with her. Cool. Kill him off. Dr. Kill him off. Yeah. So Dr. if you collect off. Toxic uh, Crusader, Toxic Avenger, um, we have a couple of these guys if you want to come get them. Do we still have the bike or did that actually sell? I think that probably sold. For I the think that sold. Wow, back. Now this, I don't have the right batteries for it. It does, however, work. I had to kind of rig it with a piece of tin foil in the back <laughs> to test that. it. But it's a Power Rangers like LCD. It's this is the Megazord Lloyd or Mega. It's got like contacts here for something. It's yeah, it's, it goes on like a, a watch. I see that makes sense because um, that's something. like a completely comfortable watch to wear. Something like that. Um, they they come in like a Calling red. Calling Dick Tracy. <laughs> Calling Dick Tracy. There was a red one and I saw one blue one. Um, it's my arch villain Zord Zord face. But apparently they were not extremely popular. This came out towards the end of the line. Um, before they did the reboot. Yeah. Um, so I have not been able to play the game. It does work. It does boot up. But I just didn't have the right size battery, so I kind of rigged it with like two smaller batteries and go. like uh, <laughs> two smaller batteries and um, some tin foil just to test it. But it does work. So squeeze his legs. Mm. I gotta send that to my Spider-Man friend. That's kind of yeah. It looks better if I just shake it. <laughs> it's supposed but to be. But then his brains like bounce against it. It's supposed to be Spider head. Shield. That's what like his name was like the that one. Centron. Yeah, it works too. He needs new batteries. Oh, he, it's battery powered. Um, no, actually, I put new batteries in him. He's if you turn it on, he'll turn on. I I, I did pretty, have batteries for that. You're one. very pretty, and I think. I think you're really sexy, and I think we can be more than friends. It's not working. I know, I'm sorry. Maybe you're, maybe it's asexual? Um, I'm sorry, I didn't respect that. I think that's on. You gotta turn it on, and there you go. There's a button, like, under one of his hands that you press. It's, like, side. really inconvenient placing. I'm like, well, what? if you, if you spin it, if you, like, run the... It like will turn on, yeah. I think you might. One's like a, you know, like a store oh. trial, and the other is like an automatic on. I don't know. It's really pretty. <laughs> <laughs> the button's like right. It is like in a really awkward kind of a space, but then it's got like a 
It's one of those ones that takes like those stupid watch batteries and it. Space Crusader. Space fighting. Crusader. I wonder if webs would work in space like that. Like if they would come out of his wrist, right? Yeah, like, like, like what would the fluid dynamics do to his webbings in space? Yeah. I feel like it would just be like a, it would just a, like, like this <laughs> mist that he just like uh, whatever machinery you use near near down was, like, <laughs> and they'd all be dead. Peter. I don't have a way to test this. Who has landlines in this? Movie? I know. <laughs> However, but his, it is an original Tyco. And his eyes work fantastic. No <laughs> sticking. So, so the, just so people know, it is an anatomically correct. So if your cat's ever sleeping, you know you can wake it up by ripping its spine out. <laughs> his eyes will just pop up slightly. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Randy. Theo. But it's extremely clean um, in terms of like the plastic so and stuff. So you can't, you can't uh, make sexy calls with it? No, no I guess no not. Sex, it, it's clean. it does have a little bit of damage on his nose and like here on his ears. Her but, eyes like... are so dead. Hey! <laughs> dead eyes is a thing. You have to like pull it. No, don't, not like, they're fast. Oh, it doesn't feed back. It just... Yeah, we have to like pull it. Sometimes it like, I don't, it's, it's broken. Sort it of. works. It's just really quiet. It's like, and it's, it's difficult, and she's missing her hat, unfortunately. Let's river dance. Like, when I got her, she had Sticky my, Pete's hat my dead on. look on my face and my arms at my side, let's just river dance. Da, 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 da. She had Stinky Pete's da, 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 da. hat on her. I was mm -hmm. like, that's Stinky Pete's hat. She didn't have a red hat. So there's a Stinky Pete hat out there somewhere with a Jesse hat on. <laughs> they traded. That was a creepy laugh. Uh, <laughs> she's a witch. <laughs> she's a witch. It's a Jurassic World, and if you squeeze the two middle plates at the top, uh, one more set over. There you go. His tail, like, it's supposed to be whip action, but it never, <laughs> never really whipped you very good. If you have a spiky tail, you must whip it. So the thing with this is because of the plastic on the type of tail, it um, the tails are usually ripped really bad. So, and or the um, kids like basically squeeze the this part up top to like this the spikes were missing so there this one does have a little bit of cracking to it but just... that's a mess of tail action yeah i thought maybe it might be broken but when i looked so it up happy. online it came can you float when i stick a rod up your butt <laughs> <laughs> and pull it out, and then you like. Ah! I'm pretty sure, yeah, I'd be floating if you did that. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many accessories to it. I didn't take it out. I, I wanted the surprise of seeing it on you for the first time. <laughs> this is so awesome. I wish I got the Battle Cat one. Oh, yeah. I so missed out on that one. Mm -hmm. Battle Cat one, I would have wore like everywhere. This one's a little hard to like wear. I'm probably gonna sell this one. There was a man seen entering the the, the bank. <laughs> Seeing Orco, we traced it to a seller, Patricia. <laughs> you're gonna you're gonna have the police questioning you about the man you sell this to, Patricia. Yeah. That's awesome. The ears like don't you gotta like feed the ears through or whatever. That's not how ears work. You don't feed ears. Well, you do if you're orcos. Oh yeah, I guess maybe it's alien. Mm -hmm. I thought it was... I'm not sure what the cummerbund's for. What's for eating? It says go. It goes around his face, doesn't it? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. What's for eating? Oh yeah. I think she found a bug. Okay. I always thought Orko was like a um, magician who screwed up. No, he's actually the, the, the most powerful magician from his home dimension. Oh, that's sad. It's just that the laws of physics and everything in his dimension are backwards from ours, so none of his magic works. Can you actually see out of that? Yeah. 
I <laughs> double dog dare you to go out like that today. <laughs> I feel like it would have been pra more practical to have that. Like, oh yeah, thing. this is not impractical. <laughs> this is not I, practical as an. I to have that thing like on the neck part, like already sewn in, so it would just like wrap around once, you know, rather than coming it's like, off. It's almost like a cummerbund. It's weird. Yeah. Is it Benedict Cumberbatch? <laughs> yeah, Benadryl Cumberbund. <laughs> um, it's awesome. Benedict Benedict uh, cum cucumber sandwich or yeah. whatever they always like <laughs> do all those memes about him. Oh, your uh, uh, band came off. Bandana. We're almost done. No. What's in here? Uh, I don't oh, that's from a game. Think try out. Try yeah, out. I think my actual Triclops figure had better paint. But I, I might swap you the gear onto him. And I was actually been waiting for this guy to come in for a while. Your sword is limp. Yeah. Oh my. Cyclops is the, the greatest swordsman in all of Eternia. It's true. That's his thing. That's his thing? You know, before he lost the, like, his eye. Mm -hmm. And then they gave him the cyclonic eye thing. But he literally is, is the greatest swordsman in all of Eternia. Mm -hmm. Even with, without having the, uh, the strength, you can actually match him on a sword fight. Yeah. Uh, I'm excited for that. I think that might be. Oh no, that might be it. Probably a little bit more. Oh, there's some Chuck E. Yeah. Cheese Play-Doh set. It, it's all there. 100% complete. Unlike me, I'm not all there. I'm never all there, so you know. And I'm also mostly Play-Doh. Yep. There should be some VHS yeah, in there somewhere. I was leaving them to last. Yeah. There's not oh, that many. You didn't didn't put the comics online? No, they didn't. Nobody looked at them. Oh. We have comics. <laughs> And some movies. Oh, stickers for you, hon. 